we should be worried, don't you think? If Elon Musk thinks we should be worried? I, I, uh, he's like in the business of that, though. Convince them that quantum mechanics really does imply the existence of multiple worlds where things look very much the same, except for tiny differences. Google's quantum computer may have just done something that defies the laws of physics. Did it really trigger a parallel universe shifter? A phenomenon that could finally prove alternate realities exist? For decades, physicists have debated whether parallel universes are real or just a theory. But now, a groundbreaking experiment inside Google's quantum lab may have created evidence that changes everything. In this video, we break down exactly what happened, why Michio Kaku is raising concerns, and whether this could be the first real proof that parallel universes aren't just science fiction, but science fact. Why this matters. Quantum computers were already pushing the limits of what's possible, but this new experiment may have just crossed a threshold we can't go back from. For years, scientists have theorized that quantum mechanics could hold the key to hidden dimensions, alternate realities, and even the fabric of time itself. But until now, these ideas remained purely theoretical. What Google's quantum computer may have done changes that. Could Google's machine have accidentally, or intentionally, glitched reality itself? Unlike classical computers, which process data in predictable sequences of zeros and ones, quantum computers operate in superposition, allowing them to exist in multiple states at once. This means they can perform calculations beyond the reach of normal physics. But what happens when they manipulate reality on a scale we don't fully understand? Scientists inside Google's lab ran an experiment that produced results they weren't expecting, anomalies that defied classical physics and suggested something far more mysterious at play. Some experts believe these quantum fluctuations could be interactions with another reality. If that's true, we may have just taken the first step toward proving the existence of parallel universes. What is a parallel universe shifter? The idea of a parallel universe shifter might sound like something out of science fiction, but it's based on real and cutting-edge physics, specifically quantum superposition and multiverse theories. These concepts suggest that reality isn't fixed in a single form, but is instead a dynamic structure influenced by the quantum world. If certain conditions align, quantum states could interact across dimensions, potentially influencing or even altering the fabric of our reality. For decades, physicists have debated the idea of parallel universes, with many believing they exist, but lacking concrete proof. Quantum mechanics, however, suggests that particles don't behave the way we experience objects in our daily lives. Instead of being in one place at a time, quantum particles exist in multiple states simultaneously, a bizarre phenomenon known as superposition. This means that reality itself might not be as rigid as we think. Some scientists have theorized that if quantum systems are powerful enough, they could tap into hidden layers of existence other dimensions where different versions of reality unfold. But how does this tie into Google's quantum computer? Unlike normal computers, which process information in a linear fashion, quantum computers operate in a state where zeros and ones exist at the same time, accessing vast amounts of possibilities in an instant. Theoretically, this means that a sufficiently advanced quantum system could reach beyond our known reality perhaps even interacting with parallel universes in ways we have never seen before. Now, what if an experiment actually triggered this interaction? Could quantum computing be the key to shifting between realities? Could it explain glitches in physics, unexplained anomalies, or even the Mandela effect, where large groups of people recall events differently from recorded history? These questions remain unanswered, but one thing is certain. Quantum mechanics has revealed a world that behaves in ways we are only beginning to understand. And here's where Google's quantum computer enters the picture. Google's quantum computer. Google's Sycamore processor is one of the most advanced quantum computers in existence. Unlike traditional computers, which process information sequentially using binary code, strictly zeros and ones, quantum computers take a completely different approach. Thanks to a phenomenon known as superposition, Google's quantum computer can hold both zero and one at the same time, exponentially increasing its processing power, and, in theory, allowing it to compute across multiple possibilities simultaneously. Some physicists believe that, at an extreme level, this could mean that quantum computers are not just simulating outcomes, but accessing multiple realities at once. 
Recently, Google's quantum research team conducted an experiment that defied classical physics. In most quantum computations, qubits, quantum bits, interact in highly controlled ways, following expected mathematical patterns. But this time, something unexpected happened. As the system processed its calculations, researchers noticed anomalies, unexplained fluctuations in the data that shouldn't have occurred under normal quantum conditions. Instead of producing predictable and repeatable results, the system output data that fluctuated erratically, almost as if some unknown force was interfering with the experiment. These weren't minor glitches. Some physicists now speculate that these anomalies could be evidence of interference from another reality, a sign that Google's quantum machine had, intentionally or not, interacted with something beyond our own universe. If this is true, then this isn't just another physics experiment. It could be the first tangible evidence that parallel universes actually exist. Why this could be huge. Michio Kaku has long speculated that quantum computers might one day provide proof of the multiverse. But what he didn't expect is that Google's machine might have already done it. For years, Kaku has argued that quantum mechanics could be the key to unlocking the existence of parallel universes, but he always assumed that confirmation would come from theoretical physics or astronomical observations, not from a lab experiment. Now, with Google's Sycamore processor producing results that defy classical physics, Kaku believes we may have stumbled upon something far bigger than expected. His concern? If quantum computers can manipulate these unseen layers of reality, we could be interacting with forces we don't fully understand. Traditionally, scientists observe the quantum world from a distance, running experiments and collecting data. But if Google's machine actually influenced reality at a quantum level, we may have crossed a threshold without realizing it. If this was a parallel universe interaction, it means we are no longer just observers. We might be participants in something we can't yet control. Kaku warns that while quantum computing has the potential to revolutionize science, it also presents unknown dangers. If we are, even accidentally, tapping into parallel dimensions, what are the consequences? Could we be triggering effects we don't understand? But what happens next is even crazier. If you love breaking discoveries like this, hit that like button and subscribe. We bring you the latest science updates before anyone else. Unlocking the Parallel Universe one of the biggest theories in modern physics suggests that every quantum decision leads to a split, creating a new parallel universe where an alternate outcome exists. This is known as the many worlds interpretation, a concept that suggests that reality is constantly branching into countless different versions, each representing a different possibility. If this theory is correct, then Google's quantum computer might not just be calculating probabilities, it might be directly interacting with these alternate realities. Quantum mechanics already defies classical logic. At the subatomic level, particles don't have a single fixed state until they are observed. They exist in multiple possibilities at once, only choosing a state when measured. But what if, instead of simply selecting an outcome, Google's quantum processor actually influenced or connected to another version of reality? If so, this would be the first time in history that we've interacted with the multiverse in a controlled experiment. But if these quantum fluctuations are real, could they explain strange phenomena that have puzzled people for decades? One of the most well-known examples is the Mandela Effect, where large groups of people remember events or details differently from recorded history. Some believe that these memories might be remnants of interactions with parallel timelines, moments where reality subtly shifted. Could we be experiencing the side effects of small quantum shifts caused by quantum computers unknowingly tapping into different dimensions? This raises an even bigger question. If Google's machine has already done this, even accidentally, what happens if we take it further? Could future quantum systems deliberately create bridges between realities? Could we reach a point where we no longer just observe the quantum world, we step into it? These are no longer just hypothetical questions. The results of this experiment could be the first real step toward proving the existence of parallel universes. And, if that's the case, the way we understand reality may never be the same again. The Potential Risks If we've truly interacted with another universe, there's a big question we need to ask. Are we disrupting something we don't understand? 
Quantum computing is already reshaping the boundaries of science, but if Google's experiment went beyond calculation and actually influenced another reality, we may have crossed a line we can't reverse. Physicists have long debated whether meddling with quantum states on a large scale could have real-world consequences. If our universe is just one of many and these dimensions are interconnected, could altering quantum reality on one side cause a ripple effect in another? Some experts worry that even minor interactions with parallel realities could have unpredictable effects, much like disturbing the surface of a still lake. Only in this case, the lake could be the entire structure of reality itself. One of the most alarming possibilities is that quantum computers could accidentally cause reality shifts that we wouldn't even notice. If our perception of reality is based on stable quantum probabilities, what happens if we start manipulating those probabilities at an extreme level? Could it result in history altering without us realizing it? Could we see an increase in unexplained glitches, sudden memory inconsistencies, or even irreversible changes to the physical world? And this brings us to the most shocking part. If you want to stay updated on discoveries that push the limits of reality, make sure to subscribe we cover the biggest breakthroughs happening right now. What happens next? Right now, physicists are analyzing the data from Google's quantum experiment, trying to determine if what happened was an actual interaction with another reality, or just an incredibly rare quantum fluctuation. If the anomalies recorded in the system can't be explained by conventional physics, it could mean we've just taken the first real step toward proving the existence of parallel universes. Scientists are now working to replicate the results to rule out any computational errors or environmental interference. If these strange fluctuations persist, it would suggest that Google's quantum computer wasn't just calculating probabilities, it was interacting with something beyond our current understanding of physics. The implications of this would be staggering, but it also raises a far more alarming question. Should we be doing this at all? Michio Kaku warns that if we keep advancing quantum computing at this rate, we might reach a point where we deliberately interact with parallel universes. Right now, these anomalies appear to be unintended side effects. But what happens when scientists actively try to establish communication or even cross into another reality? Could we open a doorway that can never be closed? And if this happens, the consequences will be irreversible. So. Did Google's quantum computer actually trigger a parallel universe shifter? Right now, scientists are still analyzing the data, but if the anomalies hold up under scrutiny, this could be one of the biggest discoveries in history. The idea that quantum computers might not just simulate probabilities, but actually interact with alternate realities is something physicists have speculated about for years. Now, for the first time, we may have real-world evidence to back it up. But as Michio Kaku warns, just because we can explore the limits of quantum reality doesn't mean we should. If quantum computing is truly tapping into parallel universes, are we prepared for what comes next? Could we be stepping into forces we don't yet understand, with consequences we can't predict? What do you think? Could we have just witnessed proof of a parallel universe? Let us know in the comments below. If you want to be the first to hear about the next big discovery, subscribe now and hit the notification bell.